I'm George Ann Chapin, Executive Director of Intact America. I'm speaking to you on Sunday, May 8th, 2022, which is Mother's Day. I've been doing a lot of thinking about what it means to be a mom in the United States. The nation that spends more than any other in the world on medical services and the only industrialized nation where the rate of maternal mortality is actually rising. There's more. Among developed nations and even many developing nations, the United States ranks near the bottom in infant mortality. Don't blame the moms. Research proves that poor women, women of color, and women in general are undermined every step of the way by a medical system where profit is the principal motivator and where women's knowledge and instincts about their own bodies, about the birth process, and about the well-being of their newborn babies are regularly suppressed, belittled, and disregarded. Intact America's own research shows that pregnant women are pressured relentlessly into allowing a virtual stranger to cut off for a fee an essential part of their baby boy's genitals. And that if they do resist and manage to take that whole baby home, they likely will have to fight off doctors and nurses intent on interfering with that boy's natural penis anytime they seek medical attention for him or even a routine physical exam. Our 2018 survey found that nearly half of all intact boys have experienced the forcible retraction of their foreskins by the time they are six years old. How stressful is all this, knowing that what you're being told to do violates common sense and how your knowledge and feelings about what you're witnessing are wrong and that somehow you should just forget about it, move forward and trust the same doctors and medical care system that's betrayed you and your family. I really get it. I hear about this all the time. So from me to you and on behalf of Intact America, I want to offer you my deepest appreciation for loving and protecting your children, for speaking up and speaking out and fighting for what we all know is right. Happy Mother's Day.